The outcome of the 2023 presidential election was positive for Singapore and bodes well for the nation's future, said Prime Minister Lee Shin Long. It reflected Singaporeans' collective choice of a well-qualified candidate. That race has become a smaller factor in voting and that there is now better understanding of the role and duties of the president, he noted. Speaking at President Taman Shamugaram's inauguration ceremony at the Astana on Thursday, PM Lee congratulated his former cabinet colleague on a decisive election win. It was good that there was a contest and Singaporeans had the opportunity to exercise their right to vote. He said, The strong vote share you garnered showed the regard and support voters had for you and for your message of unity expressed in your campaign theme, Respect for All. PM Lee said Singaporeans have chosen a candidate who is eminently qualified for the high office of the president. The people have elected someone who not only has the ability, experience and stature to carry out his duties both at home and abroad, but also has sound judgment and unquestioned integrity, all vital prerequisites for being president. He said, The election, which culminated in a 70.41% vote share for Mr. Taman, had also shown that when it comes to voting, race is a smaller factor now than it used to be. He added, As you, Mr. President, said on election night, race is a factor in politics everywhere. But Singaporean voters today look at many other factors too, said PM Lee. It is indeed a good sign that in a national vote, Singaporeans have elected a candidate from a minority community as president on his merits by an overwhelming majority. Voters have also shown greater understanding of the roles and duties of the president than previously. Noted PM Lee, the president is someone who represents all of us with dignity and grace and fulfills his custodial duties with integrity and independent judgment while staying above the dust and heat of politics. He said. He noted that the campaign was focused on how the candidates intended to exercise these custodial powers and what personal experience and attributes they would bring to the post, rather than on government policies or political issues. Singaporeans understood that they were choosing a president for the nation and not electing the next government, said PM Lee. All these bode well for the nation's future. PM Lee wished Mr. Thurman success as he embarks on his presidency and said his government will work closely with the Republic's ninth president to take the country forward towards a better, brighter future for all Singaporeans. He pledged his government's full support and cooperation in operating Singapore's unique two-key system to protect the country's reserves and key appointments. He expressed every confidence in Mr. Taman's ability to fulfill this important duty, given his wealth of experience in economic and financial matters and experience with the system. He was also sure that Mr. Taman would be able to fulfill the role of Singapore's top diplomat with distinction, having participated actively in international discussions on economic and monetary issues. The government will work closely with him and support him to make the most of his experience and personal standing in order to advance Singapore's interests and enhance the nation's status in the world. PM Lee added. PM Lee also spoke of Mr. Taman's campaign message to unite all Singaporeans regardless of race, language or religion. The government shares were declared goal to build a more inclusive society one where everyone is valued for who they are and every Singaporean has a place.